A picnic on Penguin Island just south of Perth has ended in tragedy when a strong current and gusty sea breeze swept two men to their deaths. They were in a group of six who were walking across a sandbar towards the mainland about 700 metres away. Four people have been taken to hospital. ABC reporter Mincy Chung is at Shoalwater. Mincy, what more can you tell us? Good evening, Pamela. Among this group of six were family and friends. Some of them were visiting from overseas here on holiday. Now, they went to Penguin Island on a picnic at about 3.30 this afternoon. They decided to walk back to the mainland um, on a sandbank, which links Penguin Island to the mainland, when disaster struck. The group aren't believed to be strong swimmers. Two of the men were swept away. The other four ingested quite a lot of water. Those four in that group were taken to Rockingham and Fremantle hospitals. One person is believed to be in a serious condition. The other two, the other three people, sorry, are believed to be stable. Now, the bodies of the two men, who are understood to be in their early 30s, have been recovered. A ferry operator is believed to have discovered the group and offered them assistance. Now, while this sandbank is often used by locals to go to and um, from Penguin Island during low tide, it isn't the first time that people have had to be rescued off this sandbank, and police are just reiterating that this sandbank shouldn't be used to go to and from from Penguin Island and I guess this incident today is a tragic reminder of just what could happen. Mitsu Chung, thank you. Thank you, Pam.